Hallelujah. Have you ever pondered and wondered and been confused by the way God works? You know, when you are in need, God says, sow that seed. When you cannot walk, God speaks a word of healing and says, rise up and walk. When you are in a tomb, just as Lazarus was in the tomb, all tied up, Jesus speaks, come out. How could he come out? It makes no sense, right? To the natural mind, it makes no sense. And that's what in 1 Corinthians chapter 2, when, when we read verse 14, it says, the natural person does not accept the things of the Spirit of God, for they are folly to him, they are foolish to him. And he's not able to understand them because they are spiritually discerned. The natural person, the person of the world, the person of the flesh, the person, the person who's surrounded by, by, by his senses, who's moving or living by his senses, will never be able to understand the move of the Holy Spirit. You see, the Spirit of God will always stir us up to do things that make no sense to the logical mind. When you have no money, he will say, sow that seed. When you are going through your own crisis, he will say everything works together for good. But when the natural man looks at, looks at calamity, they begin to think, how can this turn for good, right? I want to challenge and ask you today, are you spiritually minded or are you naturally minded? Are you fleshly minded? Are you moved by the way your senses operate? Or are you moved by the work of the Holy Spirit? You see, the Spirit of God will always challenge us to do the impossible, to do the inconceivable. He will ask you, challenge you to achieve what you feel you cannot. Why? Because He is God and He will always stir you up to rise higher. The natural mind will never understand the move of God, will never understand what giving, the power of giving is. We'll never understand the power of the word. It's only those who are connected to the Spirit of God. It's only those who foolishly choose to say, yes, God, whatever you say, I will do it. Wherever you lead, I will go. Whatever you speak, I will listen. I want to ask you today, are you spiritually minded or naturally minded? God bless you.